If you have a Stream Deck, chances are you also use it to control something on your PC like music when you're not using it for streaming. My name is Adullah, you're watching Candidor Technology and in this video we're talking about how you can connect your YouTube Music app to your Stream Deck. Now the problem with YouTube Music is that YouTube Music does not have a dedicated desktop app which means that if you have the YouTube Music app, chances are it's just a PWA app running in a browser window like this. Now to counter this, we first need to download the YouTube Music desktop app. It's an open source third party YouTube Music app that does everything that YouTube Music does except uh, with some additional features and as you can probably guess, Stream Deck integration. So just look up YouTube Music Desktop app. It's I think called YTMD, yeah, YTM Desktop app. I'll put the link in the description below. It's available for Windows, Mac and Linux and it has integrations with uh, Brain Meter and a bunch of other external integration. Also comes with an app. Once you've downloaded the app for yourself here, you're going to launch it. You give it a second to load. Now in here, go to the top right and click on this settings gear icon. In here, you will see a bunch of options. We are going to the integrations tab and make sure that companion server and uh, enable companion authorization. These two settings are checked off. This automatically turns off after the first successful authorization or when five minutes have passed for sake of safety. So you can toggle both of them and uh, that's it. You can close the YouTube Music Desktop app there. Now, what we're going to do is fire up our Stream Deck software. We'll just go to a new page. And here you will need the YouTube Music uh, Desktop Connector plugin. Once again, you will find the link for this uh, in the Elgato Marketplace. So just click on the Marketplace button. Give it a chance to load. YouTube Music Desktop enter and it's uh, right there it's called YouTube Music Desktop Connector and it's by Xerox Dev once again I will just put a link to this and the YouTube Music Desktop app in the description get it for your stream deck uh, so I can just click get open in stream deck here to open this particular plugin and I know it's already installed so uh, you get a bunch of functionality, you get play, pause, next track, previous, like, dislike, mute, volume up and down, track, info, shuffle and repeat. So everything that you would need. To do this, uh, the first thing that you do is drag the play and pause button and click authorize right here. It will show that it's connected and authentication failed. It's probably because we closed the YouTube music app. So let me just open it up again. YouTube Music Desktop app, go to settings, integration, enable companion authorization, keep it running this time. We go back to Stream Deck and click authorize again. And that's it. It's going to give you an auth code. So we need to go back to this and make sure that the auth code is the same as the one that Stream Deck is getting. Uh, Stream Deck connector is showing this. Click on allow and that's it it has now been connected and that's all you need to do so now you can drag and drop buttons and of course you can customize them like you would customize stream deck uh, icons and the like uh, let me just also put a track info button there so this button is actually really cool it shows you the album art of the track that's being played along with the name scrolling on it i don't like the name so i have just disabled it by clicking on this T icon right here and then unchecking show title but I'll leave this checked on for this demo let's say and uh, yeah that is pretty much it so now if I go back to YouTube music this has been connected so I can close this and if I play music if I go back you can see the album art the play pause button they're all responding and I can go next or back without any issues. So this is how you can control uh, UT music with your stream deck. You can of course go ahead and customize these icons. Check out our video on icon customization in stream deck. 
to know more about that and um, that's it if you like this video consider subscribing give us a thumbs up press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below what more such content can we make for you if you'd like to know more about tech visit our website candid.technology follow us on social media follow me on instagram or twitter and we'll see you in the next video